On today's video, we're making glazed French toast with bacon. All right, so this is a super simple, super easy recipe. And I actually had this idea when we was actually making the, the glazes. And, and for those of you, we actually, we updated. We changed the name to barbecue glaze because I'll be honest with you, they go good on anything. And uh, when I was actually making this maple bourbon, I actually said out loud, I guarantee you this will go on French toast. So today we put it to the test. And then we're just gonna throw in some bacon for all us fat out there. So without further ado, let's get to cooking. Start with three whole eggs, get the good kind. Two egg yolks, a tablespoon and a half of brown sugar. This is just a regular brown sugar, not the dark brown sugar, so. A teaspoon of cinnamon. Cinnamon? Yeah, cinnamon. Oh, I love this stuff. <laughs> and then we're gonna do just a little pinch of nutmeg. Two pinches. And a touch of salt. Oh, well, not that in. Should have used SPG in here, but that's okay. Let's get a little light whisk. Get them eggs broken up. Now, three quarters of a cup of milk. And right at a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. This is what makes it good. Do a little whiskey business. Oh man, this smells freaking awesome. This is not how we made it in the restaurant. We use eggs and milk. And the brown sugar in here is gonna complement that maple. A novel. Now, when you're cooking bacon, there's only two choices. First one is rice bacon. That's a no-brainer. It's the best bacon on planet Earth. And if you disagree, well, you better be coming in with number two, and that is blue and gold bacon. It's a little bit thicker than this, but it's still good though. But rice bacon's always the best. All right, so let's get over the flat top and get to cooking. Well, this is a thick little dude. How much you want, Wes? You in? I am. Oh, I forgot the butter. Oh, this is gonna be good. You smell that bacon? That is what I am talking about. Soak them up. Oh, that one tore a little bit, sorry. That one's yours, Wes. I haven't made French toast in a long time, but this has always been one of my favorites. And it's super simple. If you got one of these griddles or Blackstone or whatever, like, and maybe everybody can help uh, solve a fight between Wes and I. This is Texas toast. Texas toast does not come from the freezer section. Just the way it is. I've never in my life thought I'm gonna go to the freezer section and get Texas toast, ever. Never happened. Boy, this is fancy French toast. It's gonna be good with that glaze. This is our new apricot. This stuff is amazing. My thought was, I'm gonna try to make instant. Oh, damn, I almost forgot to season my bacon. <laughs> oh, yeah. So my thought is, we all love pig candy, and we all know how long it takes, so I was just gonna cook bacon and then kind of dip my bacon in the apricot. That's my thought. Oh yeah. Come on, sucker. Still got it, Wes. Still got it, bro. All right, now this is a super quick, super easy breakfast and I'm just dying to taste these new barbecue glazes on here. My thought is I'm gonna go maple bourbon on one side, apricot on the other side, and we're gonna see which one tastes the best. So 
without further ado, we're going in for a taste. I'm starting with the maple bourbon first because I knew this was going to be a good one. At least when I made the glaze. Oh my gosh, dude. This is good. All right, apricot. And it is apricot. That apricot, it, you know what it tastes like, Wes? It tastes like French toast met like a uh, jelly donut. That's so good. But here's what, here, uh, hey, this is gonna be the fastest pig candy you ever made. <laughs> oh yeah, oh man. So hey, I wanna thank everybody for watching. We got a link down below to this recipe. Head on over to CosmosQ.com, print it off, make it for your family, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. <laughs> On today's video, what, what are we making? <laughs> Let me do that again. I know I was shooting a big old long TikTok staring in the camera eating bacon. <laughs>